and welcome to my channel. I am going to be playing Minecraft Story Mode. It came out on Steam, and I just had to get it. Oh, and I get to uh, choose my character. I'm going to pick her. Episode 1, The Order of the Stone. It's a command block. This game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored by how you play. Nothing built can last forever. And every legend, no matter how great, fades with time. With each passing year, more and more details are lost until all that remains are myths, half-truths. To put it simply, lies. And yet, in all the known universe, between here and the Far Lands, the legend of the Order of the Stone endures, unabridged as self-evident fact. Indeed, it is only a troubled land that has need for heroes. This looks really cool. And ours was fortunate to have, so long ago, four heroes such as these. Gabriel, the warrior, before whose sword all combatants would tremble. Eligard, the redstone engineer, whose machines would spark an era of invention. Magnus the Rogue, who would channel his destructive creativity for the benefit of all. And Zoran, the architect, builder of worlds, and leader of the Order of the Stone. These four friends together would give so much to gain their rightful place as four heroes. Their greatest quest would take them on a dangerous journey to fight a mysterious creature known as the Ender Dragon. In the end, the Order of the Stone emerged victorious and the dragon was defeated. Their story complete, they slipped away into the pages of legend. I really but like when one so story far. ends, another one begins. Would you rather fight a hundred chicken-sized zombies or ten zombie-sized chickens? Just to be clear, you wouldn't have any weapons or armor, so you'd have to fight zombie-sized chickens. I'd have to go with the giant chickens, not because I want to, or because I think it would be easy. But because they would be an abomination. Imagine their giant feet. Like I said, an abomination. So, I've got a daylight sensor on the roof. Mm -hmm. And if I did this right, these lamps should turn on once it gets dark. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to just leave Reuben here with nothing while we're at the building competition. He's coming with us? Really? <laughs> what kind of question is that? Of course he is. Okay, I'm not saying he shouldn't come. I'm not. But don't you think it's a little weird so that you take cute. him with you everywhere you go? He kind of makes us look like, I don't know, amateurs. Ruben's my best friend. My best friend. I thought I was your best friend. Well, both of you are. I didn't mean anything by it. I'm glad he's coming. I just don't want to give people one more reason to call us losers. I'm getting tired of it. Who cares, Who cares what other people think? I know. I'm just... It wears you down. You say you're not a loser, Olivia. So win. Okay. Fine. Do you hear that? Oh, no. Whoa! <laughs> <Boom. laughs> <laughs> <laughs> oh, <Ruben. laughs> oh, man. You guys totally freaked out. That was awesome. <laughs> Axel, what's the matter with you? Great. Now I'm going to smell like a pig in Endercon. I thought we were buddies. That's what you get, Axel. I brought you good times and now I'm being punished for it? <laughs> you scared us half to death. Nothing is fun if you're not scared half to death. Did you bring the fireworks? Of course I did. So I even cute. brought something for the little guy. Nice. You brought Reuben a disguise? Um, we're going to a convention. Somebody's got to wear a costume. <laughs> as long as Reuben is happy, I'm happy. Happy? So cute. <laughs> well, zippity doo dah. Okay, relax. It's fine. You definitely brought the fireworks, right? Yes, I'm ready. I'm waiting on you guys. 
If he was really your best friend, you wouldn't let him go outside dressed like that. The only thing more dangerous than putting a costume on a pig is trying to take it off. <laughs> Hurry up and grab your stuff. We'll meet you downstairs, okay? Okay. Well, this is cool. So I've played The Walking Dead before. One of these days, we're gonna win the Endercon building competition. And when we do, people will look at us and say, Hey, there goes Jesse and Ruben, winners of the Endercon building competition. <laughs> I've played The Walking Dead before and I loved it. And I got the stand as a gift, <laughs> but I don't have any armor to put on it. Maybe someday. <laughs> it's made from tell te Telltale Games and Minecraft teamed with them to make this. Shears! Definitely taking these. Never know when I might need to shear some sheep. Gabriel the warrior. You think we'll ever get that famous? It's not impossible. Maybe I'll get famous for my sweet poster collection. Not too shabby. Give me a dragon war, Reuben. <laughs> That'll do, Reuben. That'll do. That's everything. So Let's roll. Yeah, dude. Roll. Let's go. I heard a pretty juicy rumor about the building competition, but you guys have to promise not to say anything. Okay. Also, it's in two parts. Each part more exciting than the last. Spit it out, Axel. Part one, the special guest at this year's Entercon is none other than Gabriel the warrior him freaking self. Whoa! What's part two? Part two, according to my sources, the winner of the building competition is going to get to meet him. It doesn't mean anything if we lose. But if we win, oh man, this would make up for all the losing. Meeting Gabriel would be a dream and an honor. Totally. He's awesome. It would be amazing to meet him. Reuben better be careful in that costume. The last time Gabriel saw a dragon, it didn't end well. So, does this source of yours make posters for a living? Huh? <laughs> yeah, my uh, source uh, doesn't exist. You guys are my only friends. Guys, let's stay focused. We have a competition to win. We never win. And this year we've got Reuben with us. We basically have no chance. Faith, Olivia. What? A little slice. A sliver, just a, a portion, bit. just a little faith. That's all we need. Also, I'm hungry to win. To win. <laughs> no, no, I'm with that. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. We're thinking about this all wrong. The point of the building competition isn't just to build something. You have to do something to get noticed by the judges. Okay, then. So how do we do this? We don't just build something functional. We build something fun. After we finish the fireworks machine like we planned, then we build something cool on top of it. You might be onto something. If we want to get a reaction out of the judges, you build something scary. So I say we build a creeper. Wouldn't an Enderman be better? I'm more scared of Endermen than creepers. They both have their moments. I think both an pretty Enderman scary. Would be cool. Then again, you scared the crap out of us with a creeper today. Let's build an Enderman. Ah, uh, Olivia's thing. Are you whining? The pig is no, I was saying awesome. <laughs> yeah, I think this is the first time we've decided on something before getting to the competition. Think we've got everything we need? It wouldn't hurt to grab a little more. Let's get to grabbing then. We're so prepared. We can't lose. Cannot. Bring it in. <laughs> Dare to prepare on three. Nope. Preparing is daring. Nope. That's the same thing. 
Forget it. Team on three. One, two, three, team! Bam. building we've got all the stuff for it we are so ready this year it's going to be different i'm not just ready to build i'm ready to win nice pig losers <laughs> oh great there's lucas and the ocelots the rivalry ocelots. continues man they've got matching leather jackets and everything so cool <laughs> well 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 if it isn't the order of the losers. <laughs> Great. The fail squad's here. Lucas, get a load of these losers. Let's go, guys. Yeah, go. Name, please. Axel. And uh, how do you do? No, your team name. Team name? We are not ready for this. <laughs> so much for losing anonymously. We are the... Dead Enders? Whoa. Sounds like a name for pirates. It's cool. <laughs> okay, Dead Enders. You guys are in booth five. Okay. Um there's a chest. Anything in it? Hmm. Nope. Nothing. It was fine. Is that a freaking beacon? They have a freaking beacon? Freaking beacon? That's stained glass. They aren't just building a beacon. They're building a rainbow beacon. No. We're gonna lose. What are you worried about? We've got this. Who are we kidding? We've got nothing. We've got... a mascot. <laughs> <laughs> we should probably stop staring at them. <laughs> Look, it's the Order of the Losers again. <laughs> Good one, Gil. We're just looking. There'll be plenty of time for you all to look at it after it wins and gets shown at Endercon. You're being unpleasant. Maybe not all of you. Endercon doesn't allow outside food or drink. <laughs> I'm talking about your pig. Uh, you really shouldn't mess with Reuben. I do what I want. Besides, no. what arm can a pig do? Keep talking and find out. Stop wasting your time, Aiden. We've got work to do. <laughs> You're lucky I'm busy. Hey, Josie. Guys? Hey, Petra. How's the build going? Only time will tell, but we're optimistic. Hey, Petra. I forgot to thank you for that nether star. Hey, Lucas. Not a problem. You help these tools? <laughs> for the right price, I'll help anyone. If you need anything, you know where to find me. None of us know where to find you. Exactly. <laughs> no hard feelings, guys. If you're cool with Petra, you're cool with us. So why don't we just forget about all this and, you know, make this about how cool our builds are. May the best team win. Careful what you wish for. We'll see about that. 
Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Endercon Building Competition! The winners of this year's competition will have their build featured at Endercon. The winners will also meet, in person, Gabriel the Warrior! Ocelot! 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 Whoa, handshake? We don't have a handshake. We'll just <clears throat> make one up. We'll call it the, uh... Warrior, warrior Whip. The Warrior Whip. <laughs> and just like that, I'm nervous again. Don't talk like that. We can do this. Just stick to the plan, and everything will be fine. This year... The dead enders game. can't lose. Uh -huh. Let's do it. Building starts now. <laughs> oh no! A fireworks dispenser! I'm so scared. <laughs> you worry about your build, and we'll worry about ours. Now, the moment of truth. Here goes nothing. This looks so cool. We'll win this for sure. I gotta admit, this Enderman is sweet. Good call, Jesse. Guys, people are looking at us. Good build, man. <laughs> what? No way. It's just a bunch of dyed wool! Whoops. Oh no! Ruben's on fire! Ruben! No! Come back! It was Aiden that part. The lava's getting closer! It's gonna ruin the bill! Ruben's going to get lost! Oh, We've gotta do we something! To but our Ruben. build is about to go up in flames! We've gotta get Ruben! Ruben is more important than Oof. We're right behind you. Ah. <laughs> Why can't they just stay behind? I don't see him anywhere. Ruben! The sun's going down. We gotta find him fast. He could have gone anywhere, and this part of the woods is huge. We stand a better chance of finding him if we split up. If either of you get lost, just use the lights from Endercon to make your way back to town. Got it? Got it. Ruben! Where are you? Just give me an oink if you can hear me. So, oak tree. Smoke. Could that be Reuben? To go get them. There's footprints. Mm. Pig tracks. Oh, you can't jump. Oh, Reuben, I don't want to be out here in the dark. Definitely belong to a pig. Hmm. I can hear a pig. There's no way Reuben made these on his own. There's carrot. I can hear them. I can hear Reuben. Hey Reuben! I got a carrot for ya! Where are you, buddy? Lots of pigs. 
Is there... Ruben? Are you in there? Oh, they're so cute. Friends. Stupid pigs. Ruben? No, not you guys. Pig. <laughs> All pigs but Ruben. Shut up. Buddy, you want a carrot? <laughs> oh, I'm so happy to see you.
Come on, let's get out of the open. Well, see, so I'm going to end the episode here. Hope you enjoyed. And I will see you in the next episode. Bye!